I'd like to do is adore you all of the time. I'd like to come out with Welcome back to my YouTube channel. So if you can't already tell, today's video is going to be Vlogmas Week 4. I guess I'll just summarize last week. Last week I didn't do a whole lot. The most fun things that I did is I went thrift shopping with my sister and then I went skating over the weekend with some friends. Anyways, today is Vlogmas day number 21. Literally, we are four days away from Christmas, which is crazy. But I actually just got back from the gym. That's why I'm in like workout gear. So I'm gonna go ahead and put those clips in right now so you guys can watch them and then I will just catch you guys up on everything else. Okay, so now that you guys watched those clips of me working out, pretty much all that I really need to do else today is I need to edit my what I want for Christmas video, like my Christmas wishlist video. And then I am actually going to go to a gardens and see lights with my family today And I'm so excited about that because it's gonna be really good for like a really aesthetic montage And it's just a beautiful garden and they have it all lit up with a bunch of Christmas and colorful lights and stuff like that and Then after that we're gonna go out to eat at Olive Garden, I think so Yeah, that's the plan for today. Pretty exciting. Pretty exciting. Let's just go ahead and get on with that. Okay guys, little update. I'm currently uploading my Christmas wishlist video. Um, now I know that I'm getting this up super late. We only have four days left until Christmas, but I'm gonna label it last minute gift ideas just so that it looks like it's purposeful, even though it was not. I should have gotten it uploaded last week at the latest, but here we are. Guys, my video is currently premiering. There's a couple of you guys watching. Finally got uploaded. Not gonna lie, I was getting pretty annoyed with it because it was not it was not uploading the right file. It kept uploading the file that I had downloaded before I had added all of the pictures and everything. Luckily, I finally found the correct file that I saved and I got it uploaded and now it's just premiering. Go take my dog on a walk and we're gonna leave for the Christmas light show. taking my dog for a little walk because we have to get her out early because obviously we're going to see the light show tonight. We want her to get some exercise before we go out, so yeah. advent calendar. Okay, I'll put it right here. So we are currently on the way to go see the Christmas lights. So 
I just got back from dinner and seeing the light show and it was so pretty and I hope you guys enjoyed that little montage that I created. But anyways, okay, so I don't even know um, if I will have made a video about this yet or not. So if I haven't, then here's a little reveal. I'm actually taking care of my friend's hamster for a few days because she went out of town. Let's just do a little backstory just in case I haven't filmed a video or anything about this. I did film part of a video yesterday, but I don't know if I'll be putting it up or not. But pretty much he came in this cage. Not great at all. It's quite small. The wheel is really, really small, and there's a Syrian. His name is Chandler. Oh my goodness. I have some clips of it, which again, if I will be doing that video, then I'll you probably will have already seen them, but it was so dirty. So dirty. It smelled so disgusting. I had to scrub that thing so much yesterday, and I'm not trying to diss my friend or anything, but it was really dirty. I transferred him into this bin cage. Now, I do just want you guys to keep in mind when you see this that this is temporary. It's for a few days. I just could not let him live in that cage when with me being here, being the hamster girl and everything. Like, I could just not bear to, like, have him be in that small, tiny little thing with it being so disgusting. So, I transferred him into this bin cage. It's just one that my friend actually gave me when her hamster passed and the size of Rhino's add-on cage, so it's not big really, but it's better than what he was in. And I really wanted to give him a wheel because he really didn't have one before, or at least one that he could really run in. So um, at the moment he's only using the 8 inch and sometimes I switch it out with the other inch wheel. It's really quite simple. I'm letting him use this large sand bath because he's never had one before. If you follow me on Fuzzball Hands, you probably will have seen it already or seen some pictures of him and stuff. He's very large for a Syrian. He is like very, very big. I'm sure it's because number one, there were like two food dishes that were in there and they were like completely full of food like that just sitting in there he didn't really get any exercise so i'm sure that's why he's so big there he is there he is rhino rhino is so small compared to him which i'm sure it's because he actually exercises but i thought i would give you guys a bit of a hamster update this is not something i thought i would be doing at all i'm just so 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 happy that i can care for him and give him at least a couple good days which I have a feeling he might be at my house a little longer than that because I just have a feeling. Guys, he's awake. Hello, buddy. Hi. See how much bigger he is? I don't know if you guys can even tell, but he is very thick. But he's so cute. Hello. He, w he still lets me um, pet him. And I'm going to give him a couple treats. A treat? Very cute and sweet. He looks like my old hamster named Teddy. But hey guys, and welcome back to Vlogmas Day number 22. And today, I, as you guys can already tell, I'm in front of my Christmas tree because I really wanted to bring those Christmassy vibes since Christmas is literally three days away. If you can't tell, I have, I have four of these massive bags filled with clothes and today I'm going to be going through everything and deciding what's sellable and what's just things we can donate. And there's a lot of clothes and I just thought it would be really satisfying to kind of see me go through them all. Well, it's a little food package. I'm not sure what's in here. Three hours later. Hey guys, so it's a few hours later now, and I am now sitting down to do a bit of painting because last week I didn't actually get to show you guys because Vlogmas week 
three got kind of destroyed and so I couldn't upload it. But I pretty much worked on a couple of different paintings. This one's for my grandma because she loves butterflies. This one's for my grandpa and all of these are just going to be kind of like um, gifts. They're not like anything big. I just thought that they might like like a little thing to show them like I'm thinking of them and things like that. And then this one's for my gra my other grandma. And so right now I'm going to do one for my aunt and uncle. I'm going to give you guys a good little time lapse of me painting and drawing and... So here are my finished paintings. I really like that I used like a tiny little marker to kind of do like these smaller details and I think it really made them look so much better. And now what I think that I'm going to do, oh my goodness, mm, okay yes, I don't look the best right now. My hair is crazy. I went on a run a, like an hour or two ago and yeah, I have no words. Anyways, um, so I think right now I'm actually going to do some wrapping of some last minute gifts that I have for a couple of my family members. This is one thing that I got for my sister, little black dress from Marshalls. It has like these cute little um, ties at the top. And I also got her like this just plain white shirt. And I thought that this, um, with this layered over the white would be so cute and like so trendy. Like this I got for my mom. It is just a Washington um, football team shirt. Uh, it used to be called the Redskins. Last is most certainly a Joe gift, but it is just this, this little sock, as well as this sock. And I'm just gonna be giving these to my older sister as a funny joke because I found them when I was going through the clothes today. And I was like, that'd be so funny if she was like expecting something big and just got these random socks, so. Guys, little update, me and Abby are about to watch The Grinch Stole Christmas, the live action one, which normally we watch the old version, but um, we haven't seen it being on TV a lot lately. And we're also currently just playing a little bit of chess because we do not know what else to do. And yeah. Here is little Chandler part two, cause I showed you guys him yesterday. He's really seems to enjoy digging in here a lot and I wish I want to add a bit more on um, sand into his cage. I've tried hand feeding him a couple of treats so far and he seems to enjoy the dried fruit, not so much the sunflower seeds like Rhino does. He really likes to sniff me. I'm a little scared. I don't, I'm not sure how nippy he is or anything, but he seems pretty chill. He will let me stroke him, but he doesn't seem to super enjoy it. But he's very cute and big, and Rhino's not running on his wheel at the moment, so I might go ahead and switch it out and just see if he wants to run on it a bit while he is awake. Oh, we look so cute. Guys, welcome back to Vlogmas day number 22, I think. 23, oh my gosh, we have two days until Christmas and I'm about to send off my trade swap gifts to Marissa from Hey It's May and I've been meaning to do this for the past few days but I just have not had time and I finally have time and I'm gonna be sending them off because I really want to do this with her and I think it's gonna be an amazing video. So yeah, let's go. And by the way, another thing that um, me and my mom are going to be doing today is we're going to be taking all of these old clothes, which I sorted through yesterday. It took me like two hours, but it was fine because I was watching The Office the whole time. We're actually going to take them to the thrift store and we're going to be seeing how much money I can actually get for some of them because we're going to be selling some of them, hopefully, and then the ones we can't sell, we're just going to be donating. Three hours later. 
Hey guys, so welcome back to my little filming station area over on my bed. I'm actually about to go film my hamster essentials video talking all about everything you need to know in order to own a hamster because I really want to get those of you guys that are first time hamster owners ready if you get a hamster this Christmas. I just think that this can help so many of you guys, hopefully. I just wrote like a long notes with like everything I feel like you should know to own a hamster and I'm just gonna tell you guys so if you haven't already watched this video you should definitely go do that if this yeah I think this video will be up before this vlogmas so if you haven't check out the video but without further ado I'm gonna go film that for you guys Hey guys, so I completely forgot to end Vlogmas yesterday. I was just a little bit busy and I was not in the mind space to film an outro. So here I am filming an outro for Vlogmas. I really hope you guys enjoyed these last three weeks of me vlogging. I was not able to get Vlogmas week three up, but I still hope you guys enjoyed Vlogmas week four and everything that I did. I know Christmas Eve and Christmas were more of just kind of montages. I kind of just wanted to not focus on filming for my channel and just focus on being with my family and stuff like that. Comment down below if I should do this again next year. It's been really fun, but it's definitely been a lot of work having to vlog every single day. Don't forget to subscribe and tell me down below, should I do more vlogs and things like that? I do enjoy vlogs just maybe not every single day so yeah anyways I hope you guys had a very Merry Christmas and I will be trying to get this up as soon as I possibly can so thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one bye